Yeah, it's been great. It's it's one thing I think this team's kind of done all season long is has had the ability to to continue to to you know deal with mental toughness and against good opponents and be able to play. And so coming off a, obviously a very good Western Michigan team and to have that uh, win on Saturday night at home in front of a great crowd, I think just really gives a lot of energy to the program, a lot of energy to the guys. And you could tell yesterday in practice they're feeling good and looking forward to the tough weekend ahead. Yeah, the one th the one thing that I admire about Duluth is they've got a really talented group of hockey players, but they all compete and they all work hard. They all play a two hundred foot game. I think that's why they they've won a couple of national championships. When you combine that talent with the work ethic and compete level, uh, you get something special. So, again, really important for our group that we match that, uh, if not exceed that level of intensity and and compete level and be ready to play. Um, so they've done a nice job there. But also, again, we're building. We've got some positive momentum. This team, you know, we've. We beat uh, North Dakota. We beat Wisconsin. We beat Ohio State. We beat Western Michigan, and uh, we've had some we've had some big games as well. So we know what we can do if we play as a team and we show up with the right mentality. Uh, I think we can take anybody on. So that's our focus this week. Yeah, one thing I think you're right. We've got a young team, and I think there's probably less pressure being on the road, and, and they just want to show up and play and, and get after it. I think part of it's too the competition we've had in this rink as well has been pretty strong. So uh, you know we don't read into it too much. We stick to the normal normal routine and. Uh, we got to continue that road success this weekend, though. Uh, we talked to our team about it uh, even again yesterday before practice and today, just the difference between good and great and and having that swagger, having that confidence, but doing the work. And it's really, really important that the elite players, uh, they have that confidence about them, but it's because it's earned. It's because of what you do every day in practice and your daily approach to things and your habits. So we've got to make sure that we're, even though we have confidence and even though we're uh, doing some good things, that the work's getting put in because uh, that ultimately leads to success. So. Uh, making sure we're we're focused. We had a good practice yesterday, and we'll have another good one today. Yeah, I think it's just big. You know, I think Friday we didn't have our best effort out there, and then Saturday to come out and do that and really kind of run Western show. I think it's big to uh, go into weekend in Duluth where they're they're a hot team right now. You know, they just swept DU, which we obviously know that they're good. So I think it's big that we have that momentum coming into the weekend. No, I think there's a lot just because uh, I think we have more to prove. I think uh, when they came here that weekend, I think we kind of sold ourselves short. And I think we have a lot to prove against those guys. Yeah, I think you hit it right on the head. It's just about who who comes ready to play can win any certain game. Obviously, you wanna you wanna place high in the standings. You wanna do well to represent your program, which is something that we've been building on here. So, obviously, it's been it's been good to to kind of prove a couple people wrong with where we're at in the standings. But I think we're looking to do a little bit more than we have. Yeah, I think it's been it's been good just to to feel a little bit more comfortable out on the ice. Obviously, the connection with the guys makes it easier as well when you know know what you're getting into every night kind of thing. There's not as many surprises as there was early on in the year. But definitely just going forward, there's definitely not time to get comfortable, I'd say. you got to keep, keep pushing yourself and, and keep growing as a player and as a program. So.